My name is Solo Ryder, and I come from Winnie Mandela Zondre in Tembiza. And I'm a hip hop artist. I'm a rapper. Um, I do this kind of music like I'm all about the message, actually. I cannot drop a music like just for popping packages and stuff. With my music, I want people to relate to everything that I write. Yeah, that's what I, I'm all about in my music. So, yeah. Um, why do I do music? Um, first, I was inspired by my cousin who was in Lake. Yeah. So with time and a lot of practice, I decided that why not do it for myself? And I did do it for myself. And I became better and better each and every day. So for me, music is not just some genre or something or one of those arts. When I think about music, it's like, it's, it's, therapeutic you know what I'm saying so when I was I can't spend the day without even listening to music that thing keeps me going and I ain't talking about any music I'm talking about the music that brings the message you know what I'm saying so for me the message in my content is way too much way too important way too important so it's not like I just want to drop music and people listen to it. Nah, I just want to be there for people with music, even though they don't know me. Even from miles away, they can listen my, to my music and they will still be okay. To show that like they are not alone. What they're facing will pass. And it's not the first time with them. What goes around goes around, man. Yeah. Um, What's unique about my music is that like my music like when I when people listen to my music the the thing about it what makes me happy is that they only hear me you know what I'm saying it's not like I'm copying someone else or some something or stole something from someone else the, my music is original it speaks from the heart and I'm bringing the message that people like people can write music that can relate with other people can relate but with me like my music is worth it that's what i can say um the first time i realized that i wanted to do music was the time that i was listening to music and the music like speak to my heart you know what i'm saying like i feel like i can inspire people to do great in life and be there for them like with music, no lie, like rattle to Shabbat. So, but so since I can know which like with music, I can do that. So I decided why not do it. Um, the, the first time that I told my parents that I wanted to do music, hey, the, they didn't take it very well, man. They didn't take it very well. So, but Benjamin Agwe here, like. I do not understand or I'm gonna dig it wrong. And Tabi is so we should like to make things easy is for me to study and do music at my like at different times. Because like one Buddhist are like Sanchu is called or talk a degree over again a blue shop. So I told them that I can do the same and make money with my music. But they didn't believe, so I told them like, okay, how about I do my music at my spare time and do studies, like when for study time, you see, like, yeah, who's solo writer in one way? I can say solo writer is a hard worker. That's what I can say. Yeah, solo writer is a hard worker. Uh, to back that up, I can say like, I'm a hardworking person, you see. And I say, I, when I say I'm hardworking, with my music, I say, I can say uh, I'm not talented. Now, nah. when someone is talented, like, it, he was born with it. So for me, I wasn't born with it. I was inspired to do what I do 
So, yeah. Um, how was it growing up in Tembiza? I uh, mean, like Tembiza, like people, a lot of people know that it's from the ghetto. We from the ghetto, so it's always fun. It was always fun. So playing, getting along with people every and every day, like it was fun. What can I say? Um, growing up in Tembiza influenced my music a lot. Like I can lie about that. Um. I be of course with my music because I talk about what's happening in the hood. Like the killings, the killings that been happening, the raping, the women trafficking and stuff. So the hardworking people who hustle every day for their families. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, five texts that describes me is the first one should be Wanna Be Me by Davis. The second one should be Falling Apart. That's my track. The second, the third one is gonna be Drowning, Mine Too. And the fourth one is gonna be Need a Sign by Dave East. And the fifth one is gonna be Don't Forget to Pray by Dan. Um, the people that support me through musically is like I can say the first one. The first one, the first one is gotta be King Tips. Too much. The second one is gonna be Baritone. Yeah, Baritone. And the third one is gonna be Big Mill from Limpopo, Polokwane. And the fourth one is gonna be who? Man Nega. He's not an artist. You just support my music. It's gonna be machine, yeah. And lastly, it's gonna be Hex Flaco. He's a rapper. Fix. It's gonna be my little brother, yeah, my little brother. And lastly, it's gonna be my best friend, Philemon, yeah. What message can I give to younger me? Is that I can tell myself that my nigga. You're on the right path, that's what I can say. Do what you love and always, and always, always listen to your parents and respect your elders. That's what I can say. Yeah, my name is Lorada. I'm a rapper from Tembiza. And you can catch me on Facebook at Solorida SA1, and Instagram Solorida underscore SA, and Twitter is Solorida SA. And you're watching Tembiza Content TV. Wait.